viola. If you were to think of the string instrument family as a choir, the violin is the soprano and the viola is the alto. And I've been playing this instrument for over 11 years now, over half of my life. Um, I started when I was in fourth grade with the Philadelphia School District and just never put it down. I mean, my two passions in life are music and social change, and I feel like this is the one that's the easiest way to, to promote the other. When I'm street performing, I tend to do mostly pop music covers of things like Beyonce. I recently learned New Rules by Dua Lipa, which is actually really fun to perform and I think an objectively great song. But um, really, like when I'm listening to music, I tend to veer more towards the experimental side. Um, I love listening to music like Animal Collective and things that are very much more drone-based and more ambient. So most of the time, I try to play at 17th and Walnut um, in front of where the Capital One Cafe used to be, not where it is now. Um, if that spot's taken, I generally perform on 17th and Chestnut in front of the Nordstrom Rack. If both of those spots are taken, I will find a place. Um, then I might stop in front of the Old Navy on Chestnut Street, or I try to find like a storefront that is empty or closed so that then I'm not disturbing any, any businesses. Probably the artist that first introduced me to the concept of making loops is the violinist Andrew Bird. Um, I, as I mentioned before, I really like the music of Animal Collective and how they kind of push boundaries, push the genre of music itself. Um, and of course, any kind of classical music that I listen to, um, from from music of Mozart, Mozart and Beethoven to modern classical music, classical composers like Nico Muley or Bryce and Aaron Dessner. I would describe it as more drone based. I'm really interested in that, of course, but I'm also interested in more like rock things. I'm interested in seeing what effects I can use my viola with in combination with pedals and things like that. Um, and I'm really like the idea of just looping things. I want to explore with like sequences, ink sequencer machines and stuff like that, just to see what, what I can do. Um, I just really, I want, to, I want to say I necessarily have one style at this point. I'd say I'm more so developing that. It does not matter if you think you are good, that everyone else will decide that. Um, if you're interested in street performing, just go out there and do it. And if you are good at what you do, you will make money. And so really my advice is just to find something that you really enjoy doing and just to go for that and you will find a way in succeeding.